Brandon Johansson spoke with that owner of the store about his act of defense tonight. Brandon. Yeah, Tim and Jackie, the uh, Kern County Sheriff's Office says that the attempted robbery happened here at the Azteca Market at about 10 a.m. this morning, just about five miles north of Lamont. The two robbers entered the store clearly holding a weapon and pointing it in the direction of the owner, who says that he also saw the men flashing gang signs. It's at this point that the owner had had enough. He pulled out his 357 Ruger and fired five times, causing the suspects to drive away in what was described as an early 2000s Toyota or Nissan with faded paint and rear tinted windows. They fled northbound on Weed Patch Highway and no one was injured. The owner says that this isn't his first experience with robbers, but that it is the first time that he's fought back. We got robbed before, but the, the, the first time they came, they didn't give me a chance. Plus, I had no gun with me that, on that time, but this time, I'm, I mean, since that happened before, I was prepared. Now, just moments ago, we received pictures of the suspects from KCSO, who were described as two Hispanic males, one of them wearing a black baseball cap, a black t-shirt with a white skull, and blue jeans, while the other was wearing a black and teal baseball cap and a blue t-shirt with tattoos on his left hand and right arm. Now you can see here, one of those bullet holes that came from Aguilar's gun pierced the front window. So you can see that bullet hole as you're coming in the entrance. Aguilar says he wasn't happy that he had to use his weapon, but he was happy that he had the option. And he says that it's important in this neighborhood. Live north of Lamont, Brandon Johansson, 23 ABC News.